In this tutorial, we will see how to debug your web page in Firefox web browser. You are recommended to install the Firebug debugger add-on for the Firefox browser to do your debugging. It is one of the pioneers of web debugging and most of the other implementations even in Chrome has been copied from Firebug add-on. So let us start with debugging in Firefox browser with the Firebug add-on. So again you have to right click and do an inspect element with Firebug. So once you do the inspect element you are presented with an an area at the bottom of the browser very similar to what happened in Chrome and you see the whole HTML page being presented in a hierarchical manner very similar to what you see in Chrome you had seen a toolbar at the bottom of Chrome here the same toolbar appears in a left to right manner at the top of the page area for the firebug debugger so it happens the same way the elements are highlighted as you move your cursor over it and it is highlighted also in a very similar manner to chrome the element is highlighted in light blue and you see the various margin and padding and border appearing in different colors so here we will go through these things quickly and you have very similar things that you found in Chrome just laid out in a horizontal manner instead of the vertical manner in Chrome so it's extremely similar to what happened in Chrome you can deactivate any style attribute or activate it or change it or add so if you want to add you can add attributes also very similar to Chrome and the other thing that we saw in Chrome was the visual layout of the element so here we can also go to layout and look at the same thing the margins border padding and the actual element you can also look at the DOM it's slightly different as the event listeners are not separated out but you can find the event listeners over here we'll see on the mouse move if you click on it then you will come to the script tab tab but the script tag is usually not activated so what you can do is reload it and then you will see everything being loaded again so now you can see what is activated by doing a preview which will bring up your page then you do a right click and inspect element with firebug and you are back to the place so now you can click on it to see that which function is attached to that particular event another thing for debugging is the console tab very similar to that in Chrome here you see that lot of errors has come up so you can clear them then as you move over it you will see lot of errors coming up so you can click on the error to go to that exact line where the error is happening very intuitive and very easy to do so you can inspect this element and see where the error is coming from this also has the loading times so you go to net then you see that the loading times are presented in a very similar manner as in Chrome you get all the information that you find when the page a particular element load has started when it has ended 
how much time it was waiting how much time it took to actually download that element all the statistics are there so you can actually see them and analyze them here it's a little bit more convenient because you can separate out the HTML CSS JavaScript images flash media so this actually helps in figuring out which element is taking more time to load and what is the bottleneck it's very similar to what is in Chrome once you use one you can easily get comfortable in the other so this concludes our debugging tutorial with Firefox browser